Hi guys, welcome to another video and today I just wanted to film a purse switch out video. Um, I will be moving from this purple bag over here that I have been using for a week now to this pink bag here that I have just received in the mail and I can't wait just to see how I'm gonna fit everything into it and how it will be while I am going to use it and I will probably be purchasing another color if everything goes well and if I'm happy with this pink bag but I just couldn't resist and I had to move into it and I decided to share this with you. I will also be showing you in this video the things that I am currently carrying with me for just summer so I will be naming this video something in the range of uh, purse switching for summer or something like that. Um, because I will be showing you some things that are exclusively used and carried during summer. So let's move into the purse switch out. Um, at the end, I will also be putting this cute pom-pom to the bag and it matches perfectly as you can see there. Um, but let's just get um, into moving into the new bag. So let me get everything out. First of all, I'm just changing from this bag to the new one just because I like changing my bags. This bag actually is so, so good for carrying a lot of things. It has so many compartments and basically it's not heavy at all. It's, it's very lightweight. I did purchase it, I think a year ago on eBay. Um, I don't know whether I will be able to find the link, but if I do find it, I will be including it in the description box down below the video. If I do not manage to find the actual link, I will still be uh, putting also for you a link to a bag which is quite similar. Um, even to that bag over there, as usual, I will be including the link in the description box down below the video. So let's get started. Let's open the bag and start getting out the things. So the first things that I'm going to take out are my tissues um, and my hankies. This is something that I usually use during summer. I need this fan. You might call me an old lady, but I always, always need it. So... Let's get other things out. My sunglasses, my prescription glasses, and then I'm going to take out my, this pouch has nothing, the zipper here, but here I find my foldable shopping bag. Then I have this anti-mosquito. It's for baby, but I'm not a baby, but I use it and it's very, very good. It's a lotion for, um, insect bites etc so this is also something which i would usually have with me only in summer so these compartments this one and this one and this one here does not have anything else let's get into the main one i do have a hair clip here and then let's get into the main compartment as you can see it's very very spacious it does have a lot of things in it as usual and as I show you in many times in my what's in my bag videos I don't have anything in this compartment and I don't have anything in these two compartments but I do have a lot in this main one so I have my wallet which is from Gorgeous then I've got my cords pocket that I have my portable battery charger there is my phone here which is a Lenovo Fab 2 Plus then I've got my, um, let me open it up. Yeah, my stationary pocket over here, which is this pocket here. And then I have my coin pouch, this cute kit in here that I use to keep keys in it, someone's keys. Then I have my marble look makeup pouch, that I do have a lot of makeup in there. I have my planner, which is from Franklin Covey, and this is a day one planner. It does have a 1.25 inch rings, and it's fantastic. I've got my loyalty card pouch, and last but not least, I have my walking pharmacy essentials pouch, whatever you call it. In this also marble look 
pouch it's very lightweight it's very beautiful i love these pouches i think i have ordered six or seven of these because the material is good it's very durable and it's very very lightweight and it fits a ton of things so i really like this so that's what i've got in there there is nothing anymore everything has been taken out of this bag i will be cleaning it up and store it and let's start moving to the new bag let's just put a little bit everything aside and let's just start moving so this pouch this this one here it does have this pouch over here or zip and then there is this main compartment to this bag as you can see there so it can fit a ton i still have these bags in it let's get them out of there and the bag comes with another two pouches here as you can see and it is i think it's an 18 centimeter depth and it fits a ton i think i think it will fit me perfectly so let's get started let's get moving into this one the first thing that i always put is my planner because that dictates a lot in my bag and i have decided to put it um, standing and the next thing that dictates a lot about my bag is this essentials pouch too so i'm gonna put it in front of my planner as you can see there then let's see what am i gonna be doing this is my makeup pocket and I'm gonna be putting standing like that. One thing I wanna check is where my perfume is because I don't want to put all the things standing on my perfume. My perfume is on this side, so I'm gonna be putting it like this. And then I've got my stationery pouch, so I'm gonna be putting it like this, which is also standing. And then I'm gonna be putting my wallet which is gonna be standing too, and my prescription glasses, and my sunglasses here, as you can see there. So I have already a lot into my bag, but it still fits a bunch of things. I'm gonna be putting my uh, antibacterial wipes, I'm gonna be putting my anti-mosquito cream in their lotion, and then my phone is going to be standing on the essentials pouch i have this foldable bag which is going to be going on the side of the bag also putting this one which is going to be standing until i find the right places for everything it's going to be a bit difficult to just um set it up but it will take just a while and then i have this hello kitty tissues which a lot of people have liked and i'm gonna take my coin purse and that goes at the front and i have my fan which is gonna be standing on the side here yeah so it's everything in there and then it fitted completely everything you can see what i've got in the bag everything just stayed very well but you have to put pockets standing and pouches basically need to be standing and that's uh, many of the times that's the way i do put all my pockets and pouches because um that's the way they need to be in in bags because otherwise i would need to have a very very big bag but this one just fits everything and as you can see here you can see the side and this is the other side so i will be putting this strap also which the bag came with it um it's still closed because i still haven't opened it as i said i did receive it two hours ago and I'm gonna be putting my pom-pom um, 
to the bag. Let's see how it's going to be fitting. Yes, it's such a cute, such a cute bag, such a cute pom-pom too. I really, really like it. And maybe I can fit my rose gold hair clip to one of the D-rings that I have on the side, but it does not fit. So I can probably be putting it here and I will be, um, as I said, just sizing this strap to how I use it and I will be putting it with the bag, but you can also be using it with these two straps. My bags are usually a bit heavy, um, but I need these things. Some of the people do ask me, why do I carry so many things? And I'm gonna answer that question. I basically spend a lot of my day out and about. My work just takes me to a lot of places. Um, and I do have a lot of needs while I'm obviously on the go all day long. So I need to retouch my makeup and I need also other things. And some of the things are needed to be in my bag all the time. And this is why I do carry quite a lot of things with me. My planner can't stay away from me and I can't stay away from my planner for sure because I really need to keep up with a lot of things. I usually also have another bag with me that has my laptop and my work planner and a bunch of other things such as food, because as I said, I do spend a lot of my day out and about. And this is why I do keep a lot of things in my bag. Usually if I'm going just for dinner, I would just grab my wallet, my phone pouch and my essentials pouch and probably a bunch of things for my makeup and I would just get out of the house but if I'm going um, on my routine things on my work on my day I would need to have all these things with me because I do consider them as essentials yes my bag sometimes gets a bit heavy but I can stay away from these things and the moment I try to just leave something at home, I will end up needing it. So this is why I do carry so many things with me. But anyway, I really hope that you have liked this video. I really hope that you have liked this purse switching. And if you do like this bag, I will be uh, leaving the link in the description box down below the video for you um, to look at it see whether you like it and if you want it you can purchase it i got it from ebay so i hope that i may might have given you a little bit of an idea about um, what type of purse you can use if you do have a lot of things like me to carry so until the next video bye